hello everyone it's me asmr welcoming you to my new ui design tutorial and today i'll show you how to make a fashion ui design tutorial in xd so let's start the tutorial if you're new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications here i made a window two window actually the first and second one here the fashion designer name designation and the profile and here is the portfolio I made uh, the portfolio like this and here the footer I used here the image icon and the upload options and the profile options so here the features model and the other like uh, new models and upcoming all the steps so let's start the tutorial here from here at first going to the artboard options and I'll take another two artboard according to this so select once iphone take here number two okay that's fine and we'll work over here from here at first uh, the menu options take the menu options from here here i'm using some plugins here icon for design and uh, if i search over here menu and you'll get the menu from here okay after using that you are getting the menu like this okay making this one more bigger and making it a little bit like this and like this and select this middle one and now i'll make it like this hamburger menus that's fine and a little bit smaller okay that's good and the search button i'll customize or make the search button manually going to the circles and taking the circles like this that's good turn off the fill color give the border thickness 2 pt that's good make the color full back like that and the size according to this yeah that's good and this thickness this thickness should be same here i'll give the three that's good uh i think 2.5 is good okay that's good and i'll change the color into this type of color okay actually the fill the border and the fill select this okay and now again the line tool and draw the line like this and the same color according to this the same border thickness 2.5 that's good and making it a little bit smaller like this and this one i'll place over here i'll make this circle a little bit bigger yeah and this one i'll make it it a little bit smaller that's good select these two things making it group and making it aligned like this in the middle of the artboard that's fine and now here the featured model i'll take the text from here giving the color a little bit yeah this color and now the grid from here the rectangle or a square shape and making the grid like this and a little bit round and copy this one by the help of the alter option button and you can press and hold it according to this alignment and i'll make it a little bit smaller yeah that's good select this rectangle and now i'll place the photo the photo splash and make the search like a fashion and making it search it will take time to load and here i'll select the photo at first and then this one and photo one and select this and the photo two yeah that's good and now the here should be the new one new model okay fine select this text and just place over here okay that's fine 
select this one and this one make them into proper alignment that's good and these two things uh, the box i'll turn off the fill actually border and then select all the stuffs and give some shadows and the color according to this yeah that's fine new model i'll make it into downside and now i'll draw something uh, like uh, the buttons here i'll make the button like this and making it zoom making it a little bit round type turn off the border and add some shadows so that's good and align to the text okay number two three that's when it could be more bigger like this couple of copies from here so i'll provide the tag here so here i'll bring it the layer into upper side and make the light font okay here the urban okay making it into middle of the text actually middle of the box should be the medium or regular okay light is good okay here urban like city type okay to middle i'll make the fill color more light that means those are not selected okay wedding or they see weddings okay that's fine and here okay into middle and here modern that's good in the middle of that but okay our tag is ready now here the upcoming trends and make this one into according to this and give the color from here yeah that's good now that's fine and this type of grid i'll take the grid from here by pressing ultra option button and making it bigger and now i'll change this one again here is the plugins and from here keyword like girl i'll use here okay this girl i'll place the photo here and these two things that in the text i'll just make the copy according to this okay that's fine and that's good and this type of uh, tags i'll place over here you can follow the same steps from here okay now the lower portion from here i'll take this one and i'll make it round type not too much okay turn off the border give the fill color like this color yeah that's good okay and making it a little bit smaller a little bit upper side actually it should be bigger okay now i'll provide the image icons from here here is another plugins which is the image for icon icon for design and here image or picture get the icon like this so select and select this icon and paste over here so this icon i'll place in this portion and fill color i'll make it white that's why uh, he, this background i made the dark type ash color make the icon more smaller
and here I'll provide the profile or user okay I'll choose this user or user like this that's good I'll make this one more smaller by pressing shift and hold it and properly align two things into one alignment and make it a little bit bigger yeah that's fine make this one into white that's good here I'll make a circle at first into the middle yeah and now from the plugin portions camera okay I'll use the camera here and give the color this type of color and placing this one here making it a little bit smaller yeah our icon is ready first window we just make the ready one and now here go to the pen tool and draw a line by pressing shift like this okay and this one 2.5 that's fine this one is the back uh, window sign and the color should be like this yeah that's fine and here i'll go to the circle and making the circle like this and here will be the profile in the profile portion here another face i'll portrait face and i'll get an image here so our image is ready and turn off the border that's fine so you can adjust the image like this that's good and this type of text you can put over here yeah into the middle of the artboard that's good into the upper side here the upper side uh, it should be a little bit bigger like 10 pt and middle of the output that's fine and those things that means the grid i'll make i'll take this grid actually copy this one i'll make it a little bit longer from actually it should be nice and a little bit like this yeah and here i'll make it longer and in this portion i'll make the grid like this yeah now i'll change the photos from here to fashion photos this one and this image apply here select photo actually this photo should here okay selecting this selecting this photo applying over here this one apply here okay the bigger one so making this one making it here a little bit bigger yeah select here and select photos more i could search with the girl photo that's good i can select the girl from here okay fine and now i'll select all the stuffs from this panel actually making it group and making it another copy of this so properly align with the artboard here you're getting the this window done making it safe so you are getting easily uh, the artboard or the window like that 
so how to export that select this and press the shift and hold it select this and go to the file and export selected artboard and you can export that artboard from here and how to mock it up here is a window you can mock it up or you can download any type of mock-up from here here is a mock-up portion double click over here here is the option going to the file and place embedded options where you exported the photos suppose this window and hit the tick button and save it out it will save in this window and the second one this and turn it off in the file and place embedded from here you can import the photo and save it out and it will save in this main window and here are lots of colors of the iphone whichever do you prefer you can adjust or you can make them to proper way so after making them here is the background you can give the background according to these photo colors and so on so i think this ash color is good and hit ok so you can easily provide these image to your client going to the file at first going to the save as options and you can export jpeg file and save it out and you can adjust the size and other stuff and hit ok and save it out so hope that you learned a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any kind of question query request please do comment on my video comment section until the next video i may be signing out stay safe stay at home keep me in your prayers bye bye